The summer after my senior year of high school, I worked at this sawmill in Louisiana where I was working on a circular saw that swung out this way. I was making sample cuts for crown molding. And I'd been on the saw for about three hours and a gentleman came and tapped me on the shoulder and said, be careful, son, that's the one that got me. And I turned around and he had lost his arm. And he said, my shirt sleeve got caught in the saw and that's all she wrote. Now, you can bet the rest of that summer, I never wore long sleeves to the sawmill. It was always short sleeves. But it's a lesson in life that people that have gone before us, they, they call back to us. They tell us what's coming ahead. They warn us of what we're, we're coming up on and kind of give us a pathway around troubles and trials and pitfalls and stumbles. We need those folks calling back to us who have gone before us to tell us what lies ahead. Not just the bad things, but also the good things. Like this morning, I got to tell you, Come and see. Come look at this treehouse. See what, how beautiful it is. Come on inside. Look what's, look what's around this corner. We always want to be listening to those voices that have gone ahead who are calling back, who are telling us what we can look forward to and what we can avoid. And then we want to be that voice for others, sharing our experience, strength, and hope with them to make their pathway a little easier. Be one who shouts out and be one who listens to those who have gone before. Have a great day.